Hi, my name is Paulette Morris with Lexro LLC. What we do is we sell medical compression socks. Uh, getting into the business, my best friend and partner, <laughs> we hooked up a few years ago and he had very bad leg problems, deep vein thrombosis, varicose veins, ulcers, real bad pain in his lower legs and he was required to wear compression socks. Never really heard much about them, but he had to wear compression socks every day from the time he got up to the time he went to bed. And the only problem with those socks were they worked great. Really hard to put on, uncomfortable as hell, stiff as hell, and they cost between $55 and $65 a pair. So, me being an importer, I started looking into some other things. I look up compression socks had a few folk um, sent in to me, designed some that I really kind of liked, fell in love with. After I got them back and tested one, a lot of people, a lot of people fell in love. And they're a great alternative to the tight, constrictive, stiff, hard to put on 20, 30 compression socks. So that's what I decided to do. I decided to make that my niche and that's what I do is sell compression socks now. So these are the compression socks. They're about $55, $65 a pair. They stretch. These are large, extra large. Medical compression socks. These are my large, extra large medical compression socks. The difference with mine are the designs where the pressure under your foot, across the top of your foot, and up the back of your leg where most of the compression is and putting them on is so much easier I'm gonna give you a quick with the help of my helper show you how it works hold on okay this is how you would ordinarily put on a 2030 mmhg compression socks sock and you have to turn it inside out you have to push the toe part in. You have to put it over your toes like that. Then you pull the remainder of the sock and it's a bit difficult because it's very, very constricting on the entire foot. That, once you get it there, uh, then you can pull it up and it's uh, on the leg. And then you adjust it, of course you you know, leave space for the toes, and that's that sock. Now, on the other leg, we're gonna compare it with the Lexroll Alternative 1520 MMHG Easy On, Easy Off Compression Sock. See, didn't have to turn it inside out. Oop, oop, it's on. Now, I want you to notice, put your feet flat, please. With the both of them, look at the thinness. Look at the Lexros, airy, breathable. A little thicker, constricting. It's Those a are the. Tighter on the toes. He says a lot tighter on the toes with the. 2030s where the Lex Rolls give you the freedom. So, the stage I'm at now, these were the boxes that I ordered. Originally I was going to do 2030 compressions and this was my first box I ordered last year. As you can see it's really plain and I didn't really understand the importance of packaging and how if they pop your stuff sells faster. So, I ordered these. This is my new box right here with all of my information pretty much the way I wanted it. I have to take, change two little things on there. I'm at the FDA stage now, which means I have to pay $5,600 just because. And then there's another $1,200, $1,300 in fees and then I'm legit 
legit meaning I can sell to the hospitals, the convalescent homes, the institutions, Walmart, Kmart, whatever mart, you, them, whoever, and I'll be legit. So that's where I am right now without the help of any PPP, but I'll get there. It's coming along. Thank you.